support right from the onset. And they're looking to make amends. Well, the Ghanaians should try to for their Suleimana, the man who plays the club football in Lyon. Giving the fans something to cheer about. It's something they've been looking forward to. He's been the brightest spot in the Ghanaian side. He did start against the South Sudan. A big ball into the box. Here on SL. Aziz, the Dreams FC player, been very instrumental on the Confederations Cup game. It is Kufua Samoa. Goes round. Juma. Well, the referee spotting that to be. And if Ghana with a chance here to whip this ball into the box. And tactically, see how many yellow and black shirts in the 12 yard area. Trying to make sure that they repel any attacking play there by the Ghanaians. It is going to be Aziz. Whips into the net. Pulls it. What a save there from that. Apu Magada needed to make the save. It was just hidden. Tip into the top corner there for Magada with that lovely, lovely save there. He came on to replace Shamlan Kamiya, who had a concussion in their match against Congo. But Magada simply is showing that he keeps them in the game. There, another ball whipped in. Magada comes out. Ball still dangling in a very dangerous area. Ghana with you. They have a chance. The Ghanaians have scored. Very scrappy. But I tell you what, it's already in. Jerry Efriye scores a second for Ghana. Some bit of confusion as whether the goalkeeper was impeded here. Well, that won't count. That celebration has been cut short there, but the Ghanaians would feel that it should be given. There, he pulls. I'm just talking about the 2021 team. And a lot of Ibrahim for Ghana and the likes of Abdul Fatah Shah, who now plays for Leicester City. And this Ghanaian team with it. Uh, the opportunity to find a way out and to rush clears his lines. But the Ghanaians will keep possession. Here comes Isel. Suleimana again. He's got some trickeries there. Suleimana keeps the ball in play. Looking for another strip pass there. He's able to find. This is a free And goes wide. That is some try. That is some try. I think that the Starlets are now getting themselves into the groove again. That is a brilliant try from a free. At least he had it on target, but it was just a feeble one, I, I should say. But yeah. Just to show that these players are playing with some confidence and some panache. Well, they have been players who played in the National 17 League in Uganda, so they know themselves pretty well. Ghana in trouble once again, but uh, it's been well dealt with. If at the back, very safe. Kwame, watch it. Aziz, a J gives the way to Alan Noriwas. Now he's looking for Usama. And here comes Buyanga. And again, safe throw. Sari Yakubo to deal with it. Yeah, first shot on target. And obviously, we'll come from them. I just look at the run from him. Brilliant run from him. But that shot was just feeble to the near post. But that was a brilliant pass into the part of Buyanga. What? Here comes Juma, the Kandi. When they have the chance, they try to hit from long range there, Lukwago. Wow, brilliant. Two with this one. There's Aziz to the far post there, straight to the goalkeeper. And Magada deals with it. That they just came all guns blazing, winning by four goals to two. Yeah. But here they're packed across Paul Stadium. Suleimana swings one to the far post. Again, Magada palms it out there for another corner kick. Yeah. Oh, no. His ball control is being locked there by the fans because he's lighting up the play. Suleimana, yes, a J. A oh, lovely pass now to Kufour. Sends one in. Nobody there to pick it up here. And this game so far, but he's made some wonderful runs. Just find the pocket of space, but just that the Ghanaian defenders have also been brilliant. Well, Efriye will strike from this range. Magada picks it up here. Not quite some, not some football. Yeah, you saw that little nutmeg there from Efriye. Just look at that again. Brilliant. But the show was not going to trouble Mac. Good play there, Kakande. Uh, pushed out. 
Well, you're going to draw that one. Yeah. Remember, it starts in the first game. And the second game, but has to be uh, put on the bench there. The coach trying to ensure that the captain gets a, a feel of the ball here, but hasn't really played his part. A crowd line was, remember Boate coming in. And then, of course, you talk about the his bar Aziz. Once again, Ghana coming up with some flurry of opportunities. Here on ACL, also yeah. a long range of players are beginning to shoot from their long distances. Yeah, we've, so they just couldn't, they just can't penetrate in there. And I think that we should give much more credit to uh, Moses Ochama for doing so. He knows the sort of threat that the satellite really possess, and he's doing that expertly. Good play now, Ghana. Efriye giving a chance. Oh, lovely play, Efriye. Efriye! Unlucky. Just unlucky, Efriye. He has this in his locker, doesn't he? Just look at that ball spread through to him again. Lovely control from him. And that's, that strike was... was not too far away at all, Efriye. On his weaker foot, that is some try. I think the goalkeeper had a hand on it. Sulemana will now have to deal with this one. Sulemana has been pushed away by Magada. Ball still in the box. Dangerous for Ghana. And remember Boateng. What a strike. Uh, Juma had to block. Michael Efson. Well, that's tried there. Boateng ball in the box. Ghana would have opportunities in the night already. Again for the very second time. A three-year denied. Yeah. Yeah, I think there was, there was a little shove and a push in the penalty area and the referee spotted it. Just look at that again. Yeah, I think it's a handball incident. Uh, the Ugandans are claiming it. Yeah, and that is the reason why. This one is only for Magada. Comes out and Kruma controls well. It is a free What a time to score! What a time! On the stroke of full time! Jerry Efriye, the third FC player, gets his third goal in this competition! Is the moment in for Ghana? That is quite something from Efriye. He tried it once, twice. It didn't work out, as I said. The third time, he may be a third time lucky. What a sumptuous finish from Efriye. Brilliant. That is wonderful from him. He scored three goals. He's the top goal scorer of the tournament. And boy, he put his laces through. And this time around, Magada was beaten. Jerry Efriye. It's a...